I might even look at regular donuts and I'll be like, hmm. It's not mochi. Oh, it's regular yeah. donut? I know. Oh, you wheat flour? Oh, you regular? Oh, that's cringe. <laughs> oh, my gosh. There is a French tattoo artist who is known for his unique style and a new dip that's raising a few eyebrows. Um, I think, are you supposed to go? It says John is off, so I'm leaving. No. <laughs> Cody's off. <laughs> so John is standing by with your news of the weird. Wait, do you want me to come back? Wait, you gotta push the button, because right now that's super weird. That's super weird. <laughs> Not that button. That button. Okay. The now, uh, Smithsonian call did like a clip of this. Now you got to read the words on the prompter. All right, guys. Tattoos are all the rage, and one tattoo artist in France is adding his own twist to the creations that he made, and it has made him supernatural. Say what now? Tattoo artists usually stay away from doing tattoos on the elbows and knees. Whoa! But this French artist Whoa! embraces it. Whoa. He's creating these mesmerizing tattoos that completely change when a person straightens their elbow or knee. Completely change or just? Oh, Whoa. they do completely change. Okay. Whoa. Um, well, some might think it takes careful planning to create everything. He says he just freestyles it all, which is really? then even more impressive. Not only is he a talented tattoo artist, but he's also quite the pop surrealist artist hmm. and posted all of his works on Instagram. Uh, full disclosure, I do not know what a pop surrealist artist is. I was written like, by a cat who is smarter than me. <laughs> uh, we end things. We're ending. We just started on a weird but food it took highlight. So long to get over there. Uh, calling all adventurous foodies, KFC in South Korea has a new and bizarre bit for your fried chicken. It's mint chocolate. What? This is the world famous KFC Korea. They just launched a chicken with mint chocolate dipping sauce, and we just had to try it. Yeah, pretty weird. Let's taste it. Chicken's good. Sauce, hmm. Sweet and strange. Better in ice cream. Let's see what my Korean wife thinks. Um, no. Well, at least there's <laughs> beer. Would you try it? <laughs> the beer, yes. Was like, mm. uh, in case you didn't know, mint chocolate is the latest flavor craze that has taken over South Korea. Really? The light blue gooey dip recently went viral on social media. People who have been adventurous enough to try it say that it doesn't taste at all like toothpaste. With the chocolate, I hope. When, however, the dip they say was only going to be available until August 8th. Thank goodness. I do love mint chocolate chip ice cream. There it is. Do not want it with fried chicken. Not on the chicken. Okay. All right. Well, listen, um, we've got more mochi donuts in the studio. So we're going to eat these and meet you back here. Yeah. Two and a half minutes. There's one that appears it might be mint chocolate, too. <laughs>